About a year ago last spring, I wanted a new backpack. Took a trip to REI to look for a backpack and tried on a bunch. The backpacks were bulky, too snug, too heavy, and constricting. I was looking for something lightweight, efficient, and tailored to my needs. I wanted something more suited for ultralight backpacking. On a hiking trip with my son in Pennsylvania, I realized my external frame backpack that I was carrying did not fit me. After that trip, I went online and researched how to make my own backpack. I chose Dyneema and Stretch Fabrics because they are lightweight and durable. I have a rule, always test your gear. So I took it on a test hike and I was pleased with the performance. The lessons I learned from this project will help me improve my future Mayog projects. I like my backpack, but there are a few changes I plan to make for the next one. I created a waterproof pocket to hold my hydration bladder and added a porthole for the tube. I use Velcro loops to store my trekking poles when I'm not using them. I like the ultralight style because it's easier on my body. I chose a roll top design because it's simple, easy to access, and waterproof. To keep costs low, I used webbing, buckles, and snaps I already had on hand. I added pockets and external bungee cord on each side. I added a pocket made of stretch mesh to the bottom of the bag. I chose white, gray, and silver. Those were the available colors at the time. The white also helps with visibility inside the bag. The process of making the bag spanned over several weeks. It involved a lot of contemplation, decision making, and making adjustments along the way. At the end of this project, I felt relieved to have a finished product and happy to prove to myself that I could actually make my own gear. I created a backpack that met my needs. It was a great learning experience for future projects. There were times when life's demands got in the way. I couldn't dedicate as much time as I wanted to work on the backpack, but I knew it was important, so I made sure to find the time whenever possible. Balancing other interests and responsibilities with working on the backpack was a challenge. However, I didn't give up on the project. I persisted and eventually achieved a personal accomplishment. So I am ready to go. Bye.